No, I, I was on this side, so I was in the wrong one. Oh, the wrong one? What? I think they did. Sure. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it goes towards the road. Okay. And I don't oh. know where we're going. How much are your uh, tapes and records? Quarter for the um, tapes, the records are a dollar. Okay. I'll definitely buy all these. I'll okay. sit in here sure. and keep looking around. No worries. You saw on your Cleveland Indian side by chance? No. <laughs> <laughs> Had to ask. Yeah, hey, I understand. You don't find too many people that want to buy Cleveland, so. Yeah. Okay, I'll take that. Yeah, big Cleveland fans, my husband. I think I'm ready to settle up with you. Sure, no problem. I've got your jacket for seven. Okay. That says K. Yeah, it's me. Okay. <laughs> and then this is two. And then we got tapes. So we got one, two, three, fifty. Okay. And then we need two of these for two. Fourteen. Fourteen? Yep. All right. And there will be new stuff coming tomorrow when my son brings all their stuff over. Oh, so, really? What's yes. he going to be selling? I have no idea, but okay. they're going to be moving to um, Tennessee, so I know they're going to be clearing some stuff gotcha. out. Gotcha. So. So feel free to stop by tomorrow too. All right, thanks so much. <laughs> You're welcome. Have a great day. You, Do you too. Want me to put this in a bag for you? That's all right. Sure? Yeah. Okay. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Enjoy your day. Thanks. It's getting hot and sticky now, but. <laughs> yeah. What is this copper piece right here? You know what? It was a big copper um, coffee pot. Seriously. Yeah. Interesting. Not sure, um, you know, how to use it because I'm not a coffee drinker, but. It's a lot cool. of coffee somebody would be making. Morning, how are you? Good. I think it's still morning. Yeah, at least for a little while longer. <laughs> I can quit coming to help you. I need the book. <laughs> you need the book. Uh -huh. Well, here. You gave me ten. <laughs> I'm like Jim. The more I walk around. Oh yeah, those are um, curtains drapes. Okay. They're all. I think there's yeah six pairs down there. What are you asking for them? Um, for the whole box, ten dollars. They're like new. I know because I hemmed them up for him, and he only had them up in his house for about two months. Here, I yeah, I think I'll take those. What are you asking for the uh, books? 
Um, the whole thing, I think I wrote on here, $8 for the whole box. Gotcha, okay. I'll definitely take the panels. I'll think about the books. There's lots more books all around. Okay. It's just that's a whole bunch of I mean, that type. This over on your pile? Yeah, well, I did add a couple things. From, there was a couple random boxes. And okay, everything, is, on everything was put together uh, as a box. As a box. Well, yeah. what if I just give you part of like double, like you had two bucks on one box, two bucks on one box. Okay. So if I give you like four bucks for this box, I just added like a couple things from one of the other boxes. Okay. Which one was it? Which one did you I, add from? Um, Take them out of. Because I know was, there was uh, this one here, I think, had the oh, doorknobs okay. in there. But the doorknobs are a little bit more so, expensive. How about $5 for the whole box? Then? That's fine. Okay. All right, I owe you a uh, dollar for the shirts and ten for the okay, eleven panels. Let's put these in here with them. Thank you. There you go. Thank you so much. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Back at the house, I only went to a handful of garage sales today, but I'm thrilled with what I found for only going to a few. I got some shirts at one sale. Uh, this is Stereophonic Skip Loader. There is a band called Skip Loader, but I don't know if this is. Um, a shirt of theirs or what's going on here, but it's 50 cents. So I grabbed it and then this right here was the absolute cherry find uh, Anybody that likes 90s rock alternative knows the toadies possum kingdom is just such an iconic song This is an original toadies shirt uh, It is XL and from what I could tell there wasn't really any damage or anything Very rare shirt. There's none listed one sold um, at auction I think for like 150 bucks or 100 bucks um i'll find the comp and put it on the screen but yeah 50 cents i was thrilled to find that got some cassettes and records at one sale nothing amazing in here a lot of 80s 90s stuff i'll double check that none of these are worth listing individually but more than likely i'll just make one lot and try to get 25 or 30 bucks for them as far as the vinyls i got uh Ario speedwagon phil collins and acdc got this hbo wimbledon bag has a cool look to it. I paid, I think like a dollar or two for this. And I saw some of these uh, vintage purple Wimbledon bags selling around 30 or 40. This is a neat find. It is pretty rare and it seems like this brand sells. Uh, it's Reco. It's a Reco jacket vintage. I couldn't find the same one. So I don't really know what I'm gonna list it for, but anybody watching this, if you've ever messed with Reco or like, you know, you've, you've done good with these jackets and you have any kind of uh, advice for me, please let me know because it's the first time I've came across that brand. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.